once you have your default head gain and all that sorted out, uh, you wanna you're gonna need to go into your um, after you've programmed your programmable mixes as we discussed in the uh, 8FG video on setting that up, and you've disassociated or deprogrammed the the knob that was used to set your head gain. I've got my mixes set now, and again, that was using that was using this switch here uh, for my horizon mode, and this switch back here for the bailout. I set them for 17% and for 40% um, for the for the horizon mode, and then it was 100 and 100 on the bailout. Now, what you're looking at with the software here, when you select horizon mode. If you've got everything set up properly, and remember you have to have that auxiliary channel reversed in the radio in order to work properly, otherwise these values are going to go in the opposite direction of what you want. But when I select my horizon switch um, down into the first position, you'll see that the slider down here on the bottom that says horizon channel if assigned went to 17%. When I move it all the way down to the bottom position, it goes to 40%. Also, when you look over here at the stabilization active tab or, or window in the software, right over here, you'll see as I turn that on and off that that light also goes out. It says horizon stabilization. As soon as I turn it on to 17%, that comes on and it stays on even at 40%. Also, on my heli command, at that point, not while you're plugged into the USB cable, but when, you're, when your model is disconnected from the USB cable, you'll also get a green solid light, a solid green light on the heli command. So again, you'll have a green light, and this goes into the horizon uh, gain bar down here on the bottom. If the channel is reversed, I'll go ahead and do that in my radio so you see what it looks like when it's incorrect. So I'll go to my reverse menu, and I'll go to my auxiliary channel, and I'll go back to, I'll put it back to normal, and now all of a sudden it's on the horizon plus collective pitch when all I did was move my horizon mode button, and now both green lights are on collective pitch and horizon for this switch. That's not correct, not because of how I assigned it. So I want it to actually go into uh, only horizon mode, which is on the right hand side of the horizon gain. So I'm going to go back in and reverse that channel one more time, how it's supposed to be. And then now I've got 40, I've got 17, and I've got normal. So when it's at zero, it's just normal uh, head gyro. No, no green bubbles over here for horizon or collective pitch action. When I hit the bailout button on the back of the transmitter, it's this one back here, you'll see that both of those light up and as well, the horizon plus collective pitch slider goes all the way past the gray bar at the end and into the negative 100%. And so remember we programmed in the mixes two um, P mixes that had plus 100, but we have the channel reversed. So that's actually minus 100, which is appropriate for this setup. It has to be past that gray bar though. And you'll know that it is because it'll say at least minus 100 and both of those bubbles will light up over here. So now I hit the bailout switch, and that goes, mine is, it just says minus 113. Both of those lights come on, and at the same time, again, if I'm disconnected from the software, when I look at my model, I'll know that it's working because, for one, the collective pitch will, will go up, and as well, on the heli command, HC3SX, the, the green light when it's in horizon mode, now in bailout mode, it actually blinks a green light. So you'll have a blinking green light when it's actually in horizon mo or in uh, bailout mode. So blinking green light with more at least minus 100 on the horizon channel down here, plus the two lights over here for bailout. And when you're doing just horizon, depending on the user-defined value, uh, I use 17 and 40. You'll actually see that on a one-to-one -one number right here where my finger's pointing. 17% and 40%, just like I set it up in the radio. And again, over here you'll have your one, one green light for horizon stabilization. And even if you're there and you want a bailout, maybe you're flying around in what some people call coaxial mode, which is just horizon mode. 
Maybe even during that time, there's a point where you need to bail out. You can still do that, and it overrides everything else. So whether you're totally off, you can use bailout. Whether you've got stabilization on, you can still use bailout. And whether that's inverted or upright, depending on how you have your settings in the Horizon tab.